defense wasn't as on par to what Coach Bobby Pauls wanted. A new player in on the defensive side of the bench for Coach Bobby Pauls, Amachi, as number 26, Ross Silver, is getting dressed today and hopes to make a difference here in today's matchup. Cyclones break it into the offensive end. Connecticut does a good job of playing defense and they back it into the neutral zone. Nealon picks it up for the Cyclones. They dump it all the way down to the goaltender. Chris the third, Patterson, Sherman, and McNamara still on that fourth line. Cyclones wrap it around to the blue line. Nealon's got it. He goes to the boards. Kuhn has it back to Nealon. Are intercepted on the boards and then put into the corner. Nealon takes it at the blue line again. He puts it on net. That one goes wide. Kuhn back to the blue line one timer. That one goes wide as well. Puck gets knocked loose into the corner. It's picked up again by the Cyclones. Nealon takes it from the blue line shot on net, but that one goes above the crossbar. Another shot from the boards, and that one is saved again by Lucas Veliquet. Nardone's in the corner with the puck. He scored yesterday. He got the first one for the Cyclones, which was a 2-1 to -one lead at the time as the Cyclones keep it in. But their shot goes wide, and Connecticut, that was a dangerous look for the Cyclones. Cyclones still with the puck on the offensive end, and finally Connecticut breaks it through for a breakaway, but the Cyclones take the puck back. Connecticut goes for a line change. Fry skates it in. He gets knocked to the boards. Pass to his teammate, and he couldn't put it in the back of the net. Kulik now comes the other way. He has a loose handle, and the puck's taken by Connecticut. Browning grabs it for the Cyclones in the neutral zone. He dumps it into the corner, and then it's picked up by Connecticut. Bryce Harper's down in the corner trying to find the puck for Connecticut. And I know what everyone's thinking. That's not the Bryce Harper you think it is for the Philadelphia Phillies. Connecticut dumps the puck. They're going to go on the four check here as Browning picks it up behind his own net. Puck gets broken out. As Connecticut goes back to chase, that's number 26, Ross Silver, the new defenseman in the game for Connecticut. Silver skates it up to the neutral zone. He wraps it around the boards as Connecticut goes. Faceoff's going to get taken at center ice. Sorry about that. Taylor dumps it down low for the Cyclones. Pucks loose behind the net. Rangers, it's back. Back to Neyland on the And that's just wide. Then by Kulik, he goes to his forehand, it's still loose, and then batted away. It looked like Taylor might have had a play. Puck's finally broken out by Connecticut. No icing is called. Rice takes it through the neutral zone. He's got silver on him. He goes to his forehand, passes it to Klee. Klee still has it. He puts one on net, but it's battered away by the defenseman. Adams keeps it in at the blue line. His shot is saved again by Veliquet. Klee skates it in, tries to center it for Fries, but it's batted away by Connecticut. 
by the new goaltender, Lucas Velaket. Kuhn takes it off the face. Nardone. Nardone centers it for Gerard. Back to the blue line for the one timer. And Ben Pratt shot is again. Tries to shoot. It's broken out by the Rangers. Delcor brings it. He goes to his forehand. That shot's wide. Galtieri picks it up on the other side. He wraps it around the boards. And the puck's taken away by the Cyclones. Klee has it on the boards. He breaks it out, and the Cyclones take it the other way. Delcor strips it away in the neutral zone. And it's taken by Taylor in the neutral zone. Taylor dumps it as the Cyclones go for a line change. And it's picked up by... Silver knocks it into the offensive end, but it's taken away by the Cyclones. 1.14 left to go in this first period. Rangers looking for a goal. Delcor takes a quick shot. And that's saved by Cowles. Puck's loose in the corner for O'Byrne. And he gets it off to Taylor. Taylor up to one. Galtieri skates it in. His shot on net. And it goes in. Score! But forget about the tie score. You hope Galtieri's all right. He's on the ice right now, and it doesn't look good. Anthony Galtieri came in hard, scored, and now he's on the ice as the trainer immediately is out. Oh, no, you hope Anthony That is going to be a two-minute penalty. That's going to go against number 23 of the Cyclones. Picked up again by Taylor and cleared all the way down. He's got Longmore with him. Delcor shoots off the shin guard. And another shot off the rebound. It's still loose in front. No whistle. It's still loose. And finally, Nick Cowles makes the He shoots, and it goes off the stick of Troiano. Gerard still. away. Jack Wintel Core goes shot on saved by Cowles as well. Looks like it's carried over into the second game of the series. 13 seconds left to go on the power play for the Cyclones. Fry skates it up, gets to Murphy, gets batted to the corner. Five seconds left on the power play. Taylor has it. He skates it up. He shoots. Bell Taylor, hard shot again from the side. But All the way down, and that's going to be an icing. Rangers take the puck the other way. It's wrapped around in the corner as Sherman goes to chase for the Rangers. Patterson comes in to help Sherman. Puck still pressed up against the boards. Sherman still getting a stick in the middle of it, and it finally goes into the corner. Patterson gets a big hit as he goes to the puck. And then Sherman comes in and takes it. 8.26 left to go. Cyclones lead 2-1. to one. Puck gets wrapped around the board, and it's picked up by Taylor. 
Harper, keep it in, but the puck goes loose into the neutral zone. Takes the puck into the corner. He centers it, and the Rangers knock it loose. Kept in and off. On power play over. Mass has a breakaway on the boards. He tries to center it. It's loose in front and they score! Rangers, right as the power play ends, they find the back of the net and they even the tie at 2-2. Two to two. And they do. They credit it to number two, Kyle Mass. But folks... And if cover your ears if you're a Northern Cyclones parent watching at home. I believe Ian Fries tipped that in his own net. Cyclones come the other way fast. Duncan gets it off, and that is wide. It's still loose, and a whoa, what a save by Kerridge. Came down with three men fast. Another shot off the face. Oh, Burns skates it through the neutral zone for the Cyclones. He skates it up. Hard shot. Glove save by Valaket. Period tied. Mass hits it into the corner. It's picked up by the Rangers on the boards. Taylor takes it at the blue line. He skates it up. Taylor down low. Centering attempt for Duncan. Haro dumps it the other way, and then he goes to chase through Neeland. Haro goes to the corner. Beats Neeland. Puck gets stripped loose. Haro takes it again. He leaves it off for Mass, but then it's taken away by Taylor. Taylor gets it up to Duncan in the neutral zone. They go the other way. And then the puck goes loose and picked up by the Rangers. Silver wraps it around the boards for Longmore. up for the Cyclones behind the net as a big hits put on him by Hamilton he breaks it and then he dumps the puck Silver keeps it in for the Rangers the puck goes into the corner Malcolm can't hold on to the puck on the boards as Hamilton and Longmore go to retrieve it Seventeen oh seven left to go in this second the other way with the puck Kulik brings it in, and that's going to be an offsides by Dunk. Delcor takes the face off for the Rangers, but the Cyclones come away with it. Cyclones get the puck into the corner as Silver has to go back and retrieve for the Rangers. Puck's wrapped around, but it's picked up by Nardone, and he sends it the other way. Kuhn goes to pick up the puck as it gets batted into the corner. Tries to go around behind the net, but he, he can as it's backed into the corner. Galtieri clears. Browning tries to get it, but he loses an edge. And then Andres goes around him. Andres brings it towards the net, gets pushed behind it, and the Rangers have to reset. Ian Fries takes it for the Cyclones. He bats it into the corner. Malcolm keeps it in. He tries to wrap it around for Duncan, who finally finds the puck. And then he gets it back to Malcolm at the blue line. Malcolm to Taylor. Taylor with the hard shot. Empty net. Oh, with by Fries. Back to Taylor. He has it at the blue line. Tries to leave it off for Fries, but he's going to skate it into the corner. Wrap it around the net himself. Taylor back to Malcolm at the blue line. Malcolm loses a handle on it. It goes loose onto the boards. And Haro goes to chase for the Rangers. Malcolm keeps it alive. He gets it off to Taylor on the boards. Taylor down low. He takes the puck right back. He goes across ice in front. Shot on net wide by Malcolm. That ends the penalty for the Rangers. So a successful penalty kill as Braden Andres comes back out. But the Cyclones still have a chance to score. Taylor grabs the puck. He gets hit. But he stays with it. As finally the Rangers come in and intercept. As Ross Silver wraps it around the boards. Wow. Ian Fries had wide empty net. Couldn't find the back of the net, but Rangers still trail by one. Cyclones clear. 
as Percy goes back for the puck for the Rangers. Hard shot from the blue line. It's loose in front and then batted away by the Rangers. Puck goes loose into the corner as the Cyclones try and get it in front, but it's wrapped around to Nealon at the blue line. Blasdell tries to keep it in, but the Rangers clear and go the other way. Galtieri, hard shot from the blue line, but an easy save. Go all the way down, and that's not going to be called an icing by the refs. Nine seconds left to go. Condon takes it. He goes across the ice in the neutral zone. Three seconds left. Hard shot from the neutral zone. It's deflected off Sherman, and that's going to do it here at Chelsea Pier.